picture. But... Hi, Ishmael. Hey, what's up? I'm good, and you? I'm very, very great. My name is Kofi. I'm here with your 23.3 questions. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm very ready. Let's, let's do it. Okay, let's go. What have you been up to so far this morning? Um, so this morning, I actually went to the hospital. I did some medical tests um, some time last week, so I had to go for the results um, today. Yeah, that's what I've basically done. Then I came back to the office. Wishing you speedy recovery. Oh, I'm not sick. <laughs> it was just a medical examination I had to go do for some process I'm working on. That's good. How do you tell whether your day is or was productive? So every day, I try to assess myself what I did for the day. So I sit myself down, I go through all the activities I did, and if maybe I'm able to account for something, even if it was very short and it was productive, then I'm okay. If not, then I become, you know, if it was, I feel bad about, you know, spending the whole day not making it, um, you know, a productive one. Yeah. What's one assumption people have about you? So there's this friend of mine, she's a female friend. Um, we, we actually have a lot of things in common. We actually think I like and do a lot of stuff together. So a lot of people think she's my girlfriend, but she's not my girlfriend. She's a friend. She's okay. a friend. Good to know. <laughs> yeah. What three places are on your bucket list? So I'm looking at um, Tanzania. I'm also looking at um, Kenya. And then I'm looking at maybe South Africa. You know, I'm a fan of nature, so I like to see a lot of these natural stuff, yeah. That's nice. Who is your favorite YouTuber? Um, that's a big one, because I actually watch a lot of people. I learn a lot of things from different people online. So, who would I even say? I think I'll say Mr. Who is the boss. Yeah, yeah. I think I like his way of going about his videos, the quality and everything. So, I think he'll be the one, yeah. Who is one YouTuber you like to collab with? Um, hmm, that's a very difficult one. I don't have any specific person, but I'd love to collaborate with almost anyone or everyone doing great stuff. Yeah, yeah. So far as it's in line with what I do, I probably wouldn't mind collaborating with a person. Your courses on Udemy have over 10,000 students. How did your Udemy journey as an instructor begin? Um, so... I first of all used this application called Wizzy Web Web Builder to design websites, templates, and, and, and a website for you know, a couple of people. But um, as part of it, I decided to do video tutorials to help people who found a tool to be a bit new. So as part of the tutorials, I had one person who was actually a fan or maybe watched the videos and they did suggest to me I could do video, uh, video courses out of it. So I decided then I, I'll probably start doing video courses. So I did my first video course in some time 2016 and then I had a good response to it. Then I kept doing, uh, so I have about, I think, four or five video courses and I decided to make two free so that, you know, people could learn from it. So that's how come you see a very huge number over there. I'm sure uh, most of them are actually watching the free video courses. Yeah. Making some of them free is really generous of you. Well, yeah. Movies. Do you prefer to download or stream? I'll download any day because uh, I like sometimes like to rewatch movies I've watched over and over, maybe depending on what I got from that particular video so, or movie. So then I'll prefer downloading rather than streaming. I've never streamed a movie before, actually. Yeah. What do you usually do for fun? I like to travel. Um, I like to see new places. I like to see, I'm a fan of nature. I like lots of natural stuff. So I like to travel to see a lot of this um, fascinating scenes and places. Yeah. Here's a true or false. To become a top developer, you need to program with a MacBook. That is a big force. Why? Because it all boils back to you as an individual. What really works out best for you? You could even program with your phone if, if, if that is okay with you. So I don't really believe you have to limit yourself to a particular technology or device to become a top programmer. Nah. That's a nice one. Yeah. What is W-Y-S-I-W-Y-G Web Builder <laughs> about? So that is WYSIWYG. So WYSIWYG is what you see is what you get. It's a web um, builder application, just like Dreamweaver. Maybe you might have heard of Adobe Dreamweaver. So it's something like that that uh, you can actually use to design. Yeah, I know of Dreamweaver. Yeah, you can use to design static website, a bit of dynamic stuff. But yeah, it's basically for designing websites. Yeah. What's one board game you are a pro in playing? Um, hmm, I'll say Ludo. Yeah, I'll say, <laughs> I'll say Ludo, yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. Pick one food to eat for the rest of your life. What would it be? That would be Jollof. Jollof any day, 
every day. Jollof is bay. You know? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jollof wins. Yeah, 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 Jollof. We have the entire day. Explain to us how the YouTube algorithm works. Huh. Uh, that's a big one. Um, what I would say about the YouTube algorithm is the algorithm is basically a series of you know, it's a program where codes you know designed to perform some specific tasks. So then um, you're looking at maybe um, doing well with your YouTube channel, then you're looking at a couple of things. You're looking at the kind of videos you're making, you're looking at the quality of videos you're producing, you're also looking at the titles of the video as well as the description information because all this helps people find you on YouTube. So the title should have, you know, there's something called search engine optimization. It should be search engine friendly where people would be able to search for it. So then you also have the the description aspect of it as well as you have the tags itself so that at the end of the day it helps people find the videos that you're actually putting on youtube so that's what i can say i'm sure it goes beyond that but that's what i'll be able to say for now thank yeah. you for the explanation describe your youtube channel in three words so i do startup tips i do um, tech videos as well as diy do it yourself yeah what's the easiest part of being a youtuber um finishing everything and watching your videos that's the easiest part of it, yeah. And that's the fun part to as well. Do you prefer to text or call? I am, I'm a call person. I like to talk, so I'm definitely going for calling, yeah. What's your favorite book of all time? Um, hmm. That's a bit big one. But I'll say The Monk Who Sold His Ferrari. Because um, after reading that book, I have learned so much I've learned so much from that book and I'm pretty excited that I read that book. So I'll see the monk who sold his Ferrari, yeah. Elon gives you a one-way trip to Mars. Will you go? No, uh, not, no, I don't think I will. Because um, I feel we, we belong here on Earth. Yeah, of course we can explore beyond our means as humans and the rest, but I wouldn't think, I, I wouldn't want to go stay on Mars. Nah, not at all. That's interesting. Yeah. What phone brand is your current daily driver? So I use Huawei. I've been, a, I've been a fan of Huawei for a very long time. I, I like the innovation and um, technology Huawei brings to you know, the technology space. I like how they go about their, not just phones, but their tech devices and the rest. So Huawei any day, yeah. Do you describe what the ideal ultimate phone will be? It should have a good camera. It should have very good camera quality. It should have good um, memory, that's RAM as well as space that's basically what i'll be looking out for yeah what's the best advice you've ever received to stop what i intend doing like to because i there was this one uncle of mine who happened to be in the tech space i used to look up to him a lot and um you know i used to move with him to learn a lot of things and then along the way one day he just told me because he thought i was going to you know go up and cling to him so then um he told me i should just for <laughs> dive or switch into something else apart from tech and ever since then i've actually gone hard in tech and it's been pretty cool for me yeah are you single yes i am i'm very single <laughs> what's your favorite musician of all time well that's uh that's a bit big one because i i go back listening to um, a lot of this old music and the rest but i i'm going for tupac i like tupac yeah a lot one thing you like change about Ghana, what would it be? I like to see a lot of young people become entrepreneurs in the entrepreneurship space, being able to do something for themselves and trying to, you know, not have the mindset of always being employees. I like to see that a lot in Ghana, yeah. Now, your last 23.3 question. Any shameless plugs for your viewers? Um, I make tech YouTube videos, so kindly go out and check out my channel, which is Ishmael Lamte, yeah. Thank you so much, Ishmael, You're for welcome. answering your 23.3 <laughs> questions. You're welcome. You're welcome. It was fun sure, hanging sure, out sure. with you. Yeah. You will definitely come your way some other time with more 23.3 questions. I look forward to it. Okay. But before I go, guys, kindly check out and subscribe um, Kofi's, to Kofi's channel if you've not done so. He's doing a lot of great stuff around oh, there. So. And then do want to check out my channel as well. Yeah. Thank you. We hope to come your way some other time. Sure, sure, okay. sure, sure. See Enjoy you. the rest of your day. You too. Bye-bye. Okay, bye.